Hey guys, it's Sarah from Sensational Finds. I hope you're all doing amazing. Today's video is going to be a Dollar Tree shop with me. I'm super excited to share all the Christmas stuff. I have a Dollar Tree Christmas DIY that I want to share. And I also want to tell you guys what things you should be on the lookout for to create bomb Dollar Tree baskets. You can also use them for stocking stuffers. Just all of the things that you need to start looking for right now. I hope you enjoy. Without further ado, the location that I shopped at will be down below. Let's get started and head to Dollar Tree. So the size is pretty big. They also have it in this shape. So these little gnome ornaments are new this year. You get one, one ornament. The back of it is flat, but you could stuff it and put it on a tiered tray. It would look cute. And then they have this version right here. These are always super popular because they look really good on the tree. They last, like they don't sell out super fast, but they do sell out. The little camper was here last year. I think it's cute, the glitter. Dollar Tree still killing us with that glitter. This is cute. This is in the black. I like that a lot. I like that for a little gift idea. You can put that on top of a present. Little ornament. I love the Dollar Tree gift boxes. They have so many different sizes and styles. Gift bags, gift wrap. They didn't have a ton out just yet, but be on the lookout for it because this is a must have. They, ha they had a bunch of cute ornaments like the little hat and the words that said believe in peace. I really like those as well. No, no, you're doing YouTube videos? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I always watch those videos. Finds. Sensational forms. Finds. Like F A R M S. F I N D S. Oh, sensational finds. Yeah. Okay. We're finding the deals. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Have a good day. tiny tree skirt which I got it's really cute the they, they are just really loving the black and white buffalo check I don't know why I thought these were so cute the little unfinished wooden they have this style they have the star the snowflake and the tree This is ornament filler, felt stickers, peace, joy, and believe. Some different ornament filler, which is really, really cute. Sparkly, red, white, green. If you come, definitely get these because these are so cute inside little ornaments, the clear ornaments. I have a bunch of the letters, pipe cleaners. How cute are these? I could use these on a wreath. And I love these like little snow covered ones. I'm super curious to see what you guys think. If you found the Christmas floral yet at your store, have you seen it? What do you think? I was really pleasantly surprised at all they added in. They have like this beautiful glittery eucalyptus. They have glittery ferns. I think it looks really beautiful and they're giving us some different color options. Oh, what is this? Wow, this is like glittery, what is it glittery eucalyptus. They even added in some beautiful picks 
and then little clips just a lot of different stuff one area that i was disappointed in is the ribbon i always think dollar tree should be upping their ribbon because they've been doing it but i just don't see any difference for christmas this year compared to last While I was at Dollar Tree, I saw these wooden planks in the craft section. Six of them come in a pack, so I want to make a super easy and quick Dollar Tree DIY. We're going to need one of the furniture markers. This one is in oak. The color doesn't really matter. You're going to need some of the letter stickers and also some number stickers if you have them, but it's not necessary, and some white paint. I'm going to start by taking three of the wooden planks and our furniture marker, and you're going to use the marker on the entire front portion of the wooden plank. This is a great option to staining if you don't feel like using stain or if you don't want to do it in the house. This is going to work the exact same way. Next, you want to go ahead and get the letters J-O-Y. We're going to make these look like Scrabble letters. So you also want to get the corresponding number. Press the letter down completely in the middle. Make sure it's straight and that it's pressed down firmly so that the paint doesn't seep through when we go over it with a coat of white chalk paint. Now grab your favorite white chalk paint and you want to just give it a good coat. You could do two depending on how thick you want it to be, but once it's completely dry, you're going to go over it and distress it with one of the Dollar Tree. You can either do the sanding blocks or the sandpaper, whatever they have in the hardware section. That's what I always use. Make sure that you distress it so that it looks old. You may have to go back over it with the staining pen, but either way, it turns out super cute. You can use this on your mantle on a shelf i absolutely love it and i think it's super cute for the holidays and these little gnomes inside of the tiered tray is giving me life let me know what you guys think creating a gift basket from dollar tree stuff for the holidays is my favorite thing to do things like cell phone cases name brand items makeup and beauty candles ornaments all of these things will make perfect add-ins to a gift basket or stocking stuffer ideas the most important part is you start looking now and you collect things for a cohesive basket. These little wooden crates are going to be perfect for the holidays. You can use them for small gift baskets or you can put candy inside of them. I just put three little gifts. You can give this to a coworker or to a kid's teacher or a friend. It has a stylus, a little thing that you can use for earbuds or a mask, and also a portable straw. Also, while I was at Dollar Tree, I saw these new kitchen tools. They're bamboo and silicone. They're great quality. You can pair it with an oven mitt, also a dish towel. This will give you a really inexpensive gift idea that you could put inside of a basket or you could put just a bow on it and call it a day and you have a nice gift to give to someone in your life. I hope that you guys found this video helpful, maybe gave you some inspiration or motivation. If it did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, be sure to subscribe. We're all about life on a budget over here. We do Dollar Tree videos and all of that good stuff, so definitely subscribe. If you're still here, then you are a real one. Leave the word Sixer in the comment section down below. I like to see who stays to the end and who uses the hidden word. Here are a few from my previous video. I love you very much. I hope you guys are all safe, happy, and healthy, and super excited for the holidays because I know that I am too, and I will be back super soon with another video. Bye, you guys.